I got involved with the Call of Duty Endowment because Activision was really serious about having a major impact in helping vets get back to work. I'm a vet myself, I flew planes in the Navy, and what Activision really wanted to do is take a business approach to solving this big social problem and really give back to our veteran community. So that was really exciting to me, the chance to help our, my brother and sister uh, service members and do the most meaningful thing we can do for them, which is when they're done serving, help them have something meaningful to do in a career when they get back. Believe it or not, there's over 43,000 nonprofits in the U.S. that tell the IRS they're focused mainly on helping veterans. So the problem is a needle in a haystack. We've got all these organizations that mean to do well, but honestly, very few of them really have impact. So we have a unique approach where we find those needles in a haystack and we, we turn them into spears. We find them, we fund them, we help them grow. As an example, last year we were able to fund the placement of a vet into a job for an average cost of $596. Um, that's one-fifth the cost of what the federal government does. And to them, a job's a job, they don't care about the quality. We measure the quality of all these jobs as well. Obviously, we've been doing the Race to Prestige for a number of years, and that's raised hundreds of thousands of dollars to place um, literally thousands of vets in the jobs. Like last year we raised uh, two, over $200,000 in direct donations, and this year we're trying to do even better. 100% of donations received by the endowment go directly to funding vet employment. That's because Activision Blizzard covers all of our overhead. So you hear that about charities all the time. You know, where's the money going? Well, you can be confident if you donate. You know, after essentially the credit card fees, um, every single cent goes directly to the grants to put these vets in jobs. It's been so great to work with Optic this year. Hector has been amazing and his, and his whole team, all the guys have gotten behind this. You know, it all came together when we watched the first few minutes of the stream. I'm just seeing how excited all the guys are and how much energy they're bringing to it. Not just to playing the new Call of Duty, but also to getting the community and their, their fans excited about helping the cost. To those of you supporting the Call of Duty endowment through the Race to Prestige, I just want to say uh, from the bottom of my heart, thank you you are making a real difference. Last year, we had almost three million fans watching. Um, we're hoping to have that many again this year. And we're gonna raise a ton of money, and our commitment to you is that every cent the endowment gets will go directly to putting vets in jobs, and you're gonna make a real difference through this program. So thanks so much.